this video will be kids Christmas PS4 games to buy. I have my notes over there, so I'll try to make sure I get it correctly. Alright, um, I have about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, maybe 12. I'm kind of iffy on the last two, but definitely 10. I'm Auckland. If you enjoy my content, please hit the subscribe button, like button, also share with, with your friends if you don't mind. Also, please comment, ask me a question or a comment in general. I'll do my best to answer them. Also, if you don't mind, hit the notification bell down below and give me notified when I go live or upload another video. And like I did with my Nintendo Switch games, it's, there's going to be a second part to this, and it'll be rated M games. So, look forward to that one. First game is Mega Man Legacy Collection. Fantastic games, really, really hard. Very old school from the NES. The original games were on there. So it's pretty much the same game, same graphics and everything. But they're on the PS4 Mega Man. Very, very fun. Very kid friendly. Really hard, but it's fun for sure. Good games. Continuing that, Mega Man Legacy Collection 2 there and the Mega Man games are side scrollers and shooters but they don't really shoot out bullets they shoot out um, not sure exactly what the bullet is that shoots out but it's not a, an actual bullet that you know of like you're familiar with it's like a like a made up missile or made up something that shoots out so Mega Man now this one has got a lot of hate a lot of hate. I play it sometimes, but I'm going to add it in this list. So, Mega Man 9. Not. Did I just do that for real? Not Mega Man 9. I'm, I'm going to probably get some hate for that. I did not mean to do that. I was continuing the trend in my head, Mega Man. This is not Mega Man. Mighty number 9. I am so sorry. Mighty number 9. This game gets a lot of hate, and I understand why, because it's not Mega Man, even though I call it Mega Man, but it's not. Uh, it, I think this was a, from a Kickstarter that started this uh, game, and it didn't do too well at all, but I enjoy playing it sometimes. I can't believe I did that. Mega Man 9. Oh, good grief. Alright, next is Rayman Legends. Uh, fantastic side scroller really really fun very very colorful I there is levels in here that have music in it and those levels are fantastic I mean the, this is a good game really good game next is a series of games that gets a lot of hate it, these games are fantastic and I really hope we get a third game on the PlayStation 5 I really do this is Knack. It's an action adventure, platformer, puzzler. Really, really good. I love the story in these games. It's just fantastic. And in my opinion, these are good games. Knack. And then Knack 2, of course. So I really, really do hope that we get a third game on the PS5. I know a lot of people are making jokes about there's a third game out, that, but that third game does not exist. People had done YouTube videos on Knack 3, making fun of it, but hopefully Knack 3 will exist, hopefully someday, I hope. If not, then okay, but maybe it will on the PS5. I would love to see the story end, and I think the third game will probably be the final game. Next, I cannot show off this game. Uh, I started playing the game, and it's got some... Um, language in it even though the game is rated E for everyone it's not for everyone apparently but uh, that game is Legend of K Anniversary it's got some language in it yeah even says it on the back it says fantasy violence language and then use of alcohol so it's not kid friendly next is Ratchet and Clank 
fantastic game. This is basically a re a reimagined of the original Ratchet Clank on PS2, which got remastered on the PlayStation 3, and this one has been it's like it's being retold, but it's the same game, but it's being like it's being retold through a different character's eyes. And they also turned this into a movie as well. And I haven't seen the movie yet, so definitely want to check that movie out. Fantastic game. Action adventure, platformer. You're collecting up nuts and bolts. You're using a ratchet for a weapon. You got guns and stuff, you're blowing stuff up. Your best friend is Clank, is a rat is a robot. Fantastic game. Highly recommend it. Really, really good. Next, definitely have to re recommend this game. This is my childhood games and they've been remastered for the PS4 and of course you can get them on other platforms as well. But Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy, all three games remastered for the PS4 Our action adventure platformers side scrollers fantastic games definitely recommend them for sure then next is another highly recommend another highly recommended game Spyro reignited trilogy I grew up playing the first game, never got to play 2 and 3, but of course I've actually played 2 and 3 and beat them now. Fantastic series as well. Uh, play as a purple dragon by the name of Spyro. It's an action adventure platformer, puzzler. So good. Really, really good games. And what sucks about the PS4, but, but I did hear that they re-released this game in a very confusing way to where all three games are on the disc well this is the original release on the PS4 so you have to do a download but that re-release thing is very very confusing I heard about it on a channel called uh, Canadian Guy A awesome YouTuber go check him out he did a discussion video about the re-release of it so don't believe me go check out one of his videos and then it could be confirmed but very confusing they should have done that to start with but anywho they didn't and I really hate for people who don't have an internet connection because that means they cannot fully enjoy the trilogy of Spyro reignited so fantastic games next I was kind of iffy about it but I started looking on the back so I may not want to show it off then. It's um, Gravity Rush. It's kind of iffy about it anyways. Next and last game. I don't really recommend playing this one too much. But it is Spider-Man. Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man 2. Not a very good Spider-Man game. But it is family friendly for kids. But I would recommend playing the updated brand new Spider-Man game, which I have not got it yet. But, um, yeah. But this is family friendly, even though it's rated T for teens. But, um, normally Spider-Man is very family friendly for kids, so that's why I added it in here. Alright. <sighs> Thank you so much. Alright. Bye.